What is up guys, COD Gameplay here, and this is the first official video trailer from Infinity Ward for the Modern Warfare 3 DLC Pack 1, which is set to have the maps Piazza and Liberation that is going to be released on January 24th for Xbox Elite users. So sit back, relax, and enjoy, and stay tuned for the end of the video. I'll be talking about more information from this DLC pack. We're doing an entire season of content for Modern Warfare 3. If you're an elite premium member, you get content every month for nine months. Once you've subscribed, all of the content will be made available to you directly from your console. And with this new season, it's how you'll get all that content month after month. The Modern Warfare 3 DLC season kicks off with two multiplayer maps. One is called Piazza. This takes place on the coast of Italy. The second is Liberation, and this one takes place in Manhattan. Liberation is awesome because it takes place in New York. It's one of those maps that have such iconic locations in it that you can easily call it out about the castle or fighting by the fountain. For Liberation, I think one of the big strategies that you want to try to follow is there's a lot of sniper sight lines, and you need to be cautious when you're crossing it. Don't run and gun, a little bit more methodical, and that's gonna help you survive that map. Piazza is a different type of map altogether. It's a very vertical, chaotic route map. It's primarily geared towards the guys who like the really close up run and gun. You gotta be fast. It's a challenging map, it's a technical map, but also it's important to stick with your teammates where they're covering a few cover points and you're covering a few is definitely the way you're gonna survive that map. The cool thing with Modern Warfare 3 and this entire season of content is that we have so many different opportunities with our season. Awesome multiplayer, new Spec Ops missions, extensions from the story, new game modes that we can add. We're really trying to make sure that the whole idea of the season of content is integrated not just in the maps themselves, but also within Elite. We have that entire super passionate, super vocal audience that we can pull inspiration from. We're going to start engaging the community actually in the creation of the content. It's just a much more community-friendly DLC plan than we've ever had before. I mean, with Infinity Ward, Sledgehammer, and Raven Games all contributing to the season of content, the possibilities are limitless. The season of Modern Warfare 3 content for Elite Premium members kicks off on January 24th, first on Xbox Live. So now you guys are probably already wondering why are there only two maps? Usually in Call of Duty, there's three maps on the map packs that are released, maybe even four, but there's only two. I paid for Elite, possibly, and I'm only getting two maps, and the answer for that is because what they'll be doing is that they'll be releasing monthly DLC packs. You notice that they never ever said map pack. So when they never said map pack in past interviews with Robert Bowling, he said there's, there's not going to be just maps. And so even though they're showcasing all the maps and everything because that's the main thing that people are looking for is the new maps, there's going to be more. I swear there's going to be more. Spec Ops missions, possibly a new gun, I don't know, but definitely Spec Ops missions, definitely a new, new map. So the two new maps that they said are Piazza and Liberation. So some things that they said were that Liberation is going to have um, lots of sniper. And I, I don't know if that's good or bad, because I love sniping. But last time when they said that it's a really good sniper map, it turned out to be a really, really good camper map. And not only a lot of people started moving. The other map that they said, which is Liberation, said that it is very close quarters. And that I would suggest using an SMG, because obviously if this is so close quarters, Something like a sniper <laughs> that they're showing is probably not going to do the best thing for you. One more thing is that they said that the release date was January 24th for Xbox Elite users. Keep in mind, PS3 and PC and regular Xbox users are going to be different. Now they have still not said anything about the other release dates, so if you do not have Elite on the Xbox 360 console, then expect it later. I'm guessing PS3 Elite is going to be around 3 weeks later. And then the normal Xbox 
and P PS3 regular is going to be another like two weeks later, followed by the PC as well. So I'm guessing what they're going to do is going to still put the PS3 Elite um, a little bit ahead of the regular Xbox, I'd hope. Because even though Microsoft did the little payout to Activision, I still think that Elite users should get the benefit even if you're PS3 or Xbox 360. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, and if you did enjoy and stay this far, please do give it a like, maybe a favorite, and subscribe if you're new to my channel for more Modern Warfare 3 information. Anyways, I'm Cog Gameplay, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys later.